Welcome guys to the Bike Man for You. We are committed to showing you everything that has to do with pedaling and the International Surrey Company is no exception. Welcome to the Bike Man for You guys. Customer ordered it, shipped it, needs us to put it together, hires us to put it together, no problem. We're coming around, we're just getting finishing, we're doing some of the finishing touches with it. I really wanted to share it with you guys. Uh, the International Surrey Company Limited, pedaling since 1970. www.surreycompany.com. Check them out. Um, pretty cool stuff they got going on here. I want to just uh, share with you uh, their experience. They've been doing it for a long, long time. 1970. I remember going to a bike show and my mother saying, uh, wow, let's get some of these. My father and I, we both kind of agreed that, you know, the thing is tough. It's not ready to get, get, it has a, yeah, there's four people, but you know what? It just doesn't have enough oomph to get it out of its own way. But it's a great application for a lot of fun. Uh, we probably should have done it those years back then. And now I'm thinking maybe it's time to do it again. They get a whole bunch of different models. One of the things they have is the Hitchhiker, which is a 12 uh, excuse me, a thousand watt motor that you would hook onto the back. Really, really kind of cool, making it easy. Uh, the next thing they got kind of is uh, a couple of other little items like some beach cruisers and that kind of thing. Some adult like big wheel type items. But the thing I liked and what caught my eye was this Impello. Uh, very cool. I remember these things in the 70s. Some of you guys might remember something similar. They were yellow and white. Here's something a little bit, maybe it's a newer style. Maybe we should think about renting one of these, and getting one of these and renting it next year. The other, now I, I'm saving, here's what we got here right now is the Surrey Deluxe. We happen to have the four person model. Okay, now we start getting into some of the real cool, cool. Here's a six person or eight person or the stretch limo model or you know, as many as you can pile on model. And then you got the tram model as well. But this is what really caught my eye. The bar cycle. 15 people on the bar cycle. I think we gotta definitely get one of those. So let's go around and check out the rest of this bicycle. Uh, or, it's not really a bicycle, it's a quad cycle. Very nicely, it went together. It's a nice finish. I'm kind of impressed with it. It's, the mechanisms are cool. Uh, there's a whole bunch of nuts and bolts. We got everything when you're assembling one of these things. Put it finger tight. Uh, so important because you want to make sure you get something lined up because inevitably you're going to have to take something off in order to put another thing on and then you're going to have to put that thing back on again. So don't make it wicked tight to begin with. Put it all finger tight and then go over the thing with a fine tooth comb and assemble each and every nut and bolt. The wheels on this thing, heavy duty, big fat monster gauge spokes. Rack and pinion steering. Here's an example of when I had a problem with, I forgot these boots. So I had this thing all assembled, but I gotta put the boot on. It came in this big monster crate. It was just a mess. Yeah, I'll show uh, them in bike man. Yeah, there's the crate, empty crate, not even once, not one spare part. So uh, the whole thing went came in that crate, it was pretty big and it, it's heavy, it ain't light. Uh, the next thing we're doing here is uh, we were working on is these brakes. And uh, son of a, come on over and let me show you the brake system on this baby. It is a, you know, it's, you can see how it goes. It goes via a chain, but the brake system, this is it over here. You're going to miss it. You got to get that turn around. It's a drum style brake. And in our next video, I'm going to show you how to adjust it because here's how it comes when it comes. And I had to, you can see there's no adjustment left and it really doesn't work that great. So we're going to adjust it down here and I'm going to show you what we're going to do. But it, it, oh, not only on one side, but on the other side as well. As you can see, they're continually keeping that right hand drive. Both sides of the bicycle or the quad cycle are on the drive on the right side. Uh, kind of neat. What was I going to go? Oh, I want to show you the chain tensioner. Here's where that brake lever is. The brake lever is on the gear shift. Okay. So there's how that brake 
actually works. Three on the tree. Three on the tree, baby. Uh, again, that rack and pinion steering. And then you not everybody has to be pedaling. Only one person can pedal or all four can pedal or you can coast or do whatever you want to do because uh, there's an independent uh, freewheel in each one of the cranks. The spring tension or uh, chain tension is tensioned pretty nicely with this heavy duty spring and a rubber poly type of, you know, and this goes up and down and it keeps a good perfect tension on it. Uh, very impressed with that. I uh, kind of like that. Other than that, I mean, the thing is basically a bunch of bicycle parts, regular pedals. It's a, the crank is a little bit different. But again, if you need any parts, you can get them from them. Uh, obviously, do not step on the chain guard. Uh, that's, that's why they say keep your feet off. Uh, pretty cool. We're going to get a rest. But the rest of the way, we got a canopy that goes on top. Whew, it's going to be cool. Uh, once we get her going, we'll do, give you a video on that. But I uh, just thought I'd give you an update. Hope you enjoy. The International surrey company never fear the bike man for you is here